Hey everybody, it's Wooju here. Uh, just sitting here watching a little football, uh, watching Nate Davis play. Not been playing too bad tonight. Nice pass to Ted again. But uh, anyhow, finally time for another mail day. I'll have more stuff coming in this week, but fair go ahead and do a quick little mail day. Um, start off with the cards, plus I got a little silver to show, of course. Uh, I got a little more silver in. Uh, been doing a lot of trading on the forums to get some cards and also selling stuff to get cards, so pretty much how I've been doing everything as of late. Um, and a trade, I did trade away, I think, like a Centennial Holmes SPX rookie autograph jersey. I uh, got two cards in return. First off, a new 1998 Playoff Prestige rookie card of Heinz Ward for my PC. Not major books for 10 bucks, but, you know, I mean, book value versus sell value on rookie cards. Now that goes, but the main card I got back in the trade, 92 out of 244, Chris Johnson, SP Authentics autograph, rookie year, not technically a rookie card, but rookie year. Uh, then I did a little trading to get, let's see, put the two cards together, trading to get these two cards. First, uh, Proline Classic Live, on-card autograph, 260 out of 1085, Derek Thomas. Don't see a whole lot of his autographs anyhow, but it's a nice clean autograph. Card's a little dinged up here on top, but hard to get his autograph. It's a nice addition to the Hall of Fame, and then um, we had to nail out a little bit more of a trade, so we threw this in. 1997 Upper Deck Legends Mike Singletary on-card autograph, so that was a nice upgrade to my Singletary. Uh, then I got a couple nice uh, 97 Legends autographs for pretty cheap. Uh, Anthony uh, Munez from the Bengals, Ken Houston from the Redskins, inscribed Hall of Fame, 86 I believe it is, and a Sam Huff on-card autograph from the New York Giants. Uh, I traded to get this card. Uh, this is a 1998 Topps Hall of Fame on-card autograph. From the New, uh, New York, yeah, Miami Dolphins, Dwight Stevenson. Very nice looking autograph on there. And the big card, uh, I'm sure most of you saw the mail day from Alan Techno Bailey, uh, where I sold him the Ostremski and the Ted Williams. Um, yeah, well, I sold those to him in order to get this. 1999 Upper Deck Retro on card autograph. Of Walter Payton. Very clean autograph. There's a few little misses here and there, like just from the pen running, not running, but just kind of drying a little bit. But otherwise, very clean. Car's in good shape. I wouldn't say gradable. Thinking about getting it sent in to JSA just for authentication reasons, just so I know 100% and will always know that it's authentic. I'm sure it is, but it's just one of those security things I'm thinking of doing, not sure yet. So, very nice uh, pick up there for the PC, obviously. I now have an extra water Payton autograph that's probably going to end up either going up for sale or uh, trade if I can find something really nice um, that I want. Anyhow, last little bit of the mail day here. Um, did some silver buying. Took a while to, I had to pester all three people to get my stuff. One did give me a $10 refund, so that cost me $8.50 for the bar. Uh, this first one is a Engelhard 999 plus fine silver 1 troy ounce. A little tarnish there, you can see. A little cleaning up would do it some good, but pretty nice bar. And then they threw in, the guy throws all these into his little auctions, like the little gold leaf and silver and blah, blah, blah. Not really worth the tinker's cuss unless you have like millions of these little things you can melt them down. Yeah, don't really add any value, but people bid on it higher. So, but I was able to get one for reasonable price what they're going for without all that stuff. Uh, this next bar um, just kind of looked like a nice bar. Picked it up for right around spot at the time actually. Uh, just says happy birthday, but on the back it does say one troy ounce and nine five. Nah. 999 fine silver, nice and shiny there on the back, on Troy Ounce. That's the one that sent me $10 back for forgetting to send out the package, so 
Big thanks to that seller. I mean, that, they didn't have to. As long as they got me the package, that's all I cared. But hey, 10 bucks back is 10 bucks back. And this last bar, again, I had to pester the person. They had some family issues, I guess. But at least I got all three bars without anybody backing out on me. Um, just an American flag, silver bar, sealed. Again, on the back, one ounce, 999, fine silver. So. Definitely lots of nice stuff in here. Silver, Walter Payton, Hall of Famers out the wazoo. Definitely a nice mail day. I'm going to have some more stuff coming in tomorrow. Uh, but I'll just save them up as I usually do for a nice mail day. And you'll see another video like this probably about a week or so. It's going to be two weeks before our next group break, though, because we only do it first and third of each month. First and third Sundays of each month. So, But, yeah, that's it for uh, today, folks. I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope you enjoyed the nice stuff that I just got in. Um, probably be selling more stuff here pretty soon, depending on how things go next week. So uh, watch out for a possible sale video. Who knows? As always, folks, thanks for watching.